Good evening, everyone. My name is Steven. In order for me to do my part in making sure that we're all safe, I am here, isolated by myself, alone. But that's okay, because I get to celebrate the holidays with all of you. So join me for this festive evening as I review the Mr. Beast Burger, started by YouTube philanthropist Mr. Beast. Now, I don't know what his first name is, so I'll just refer to him as Mr. Beast. Mr. Beast decided to spread the holiday cheers by helping over 300 struggling local businesses by having them make burgers on the side. Now, my Mr. Beast burger has been prepared meticulously by a very famous high-end Italian restaurant that some of you may know as Buca di Beppo. Because we're having fine Italian cuisine tonight, I thought it would be especially appropriate to pair it with this Italian wine, the Rioniti Labrusco from Emilia Romagna. Wow, it has a very powerful, robust, even bitter dark cherry and grape scent. Surprisingly and remarkably, it tasted really sweet, not bitter at all. It's like a nice alcoholic berry flavored LaCroix or even a White Claw. Here we have the beef style burger with two smashed beef patties, American cheese from probably France, diced onions, mayonnaise, brown mustard, and ketchup probably made with the Roma tomatoes from Buca de Beppo's kitchen, served with a generous portion of anti-pasto seasoned fried potatoes. Cutting this is like candy elks. Well, the beef is slightly pink, looks like it's medium, just like how I like my steak. In the end, I was immensely disappointed with my meal. The entree and the antipasto were as cold as gelato. And I really feel like I couldn't fault them on that because it's delivery and delivery takes time. I mean, I like the pickles. They were very refreshing, crispy, and tangy. But overall, the meal was just very bland. And I don't know why, because the fries looked like they were well seasoned. In fact, I think this meal was almost a lost cause if it wasn't for the wine because the sweetness of the wine actually compensated for the lack of flavor in this meal. The bun, beef patty, and fried potatoes were so tough that it was really hard to digest and I really needed that wine to help wash down everything. Now by itself, I would give this meal a one. But because of the wine, I think that improves it. And because of Mr. Pieces, well intentions and it's the holidays and I'm, I mean the holiday spirit, I would increase this and give this a two out of five wines. So how are you spending your holidays? What are you having for your holiday meal? Please let me know in the comments. Until next time, happy holidays. <laughs>